Hi guys, welcome back to the new video. Sorry it's been a long time. I managed to get a bit of metal in my eye and it took over two weeks to heal. I also had various other jobs to do and I just wanted to break from it. So let's get on and you can see what I've been up to. On a previous video, I started this rust repair. So we'll start off with continuing with this. That's that finish now. Not the best repair, but at least it's tidy and no rust. On this video, I'm going to repair the chassis rails. They're going to be completely cut out and replaced with all new metal. As you can see, they're completely bent out of shape and rusted away. Loads of rust and dirt inside. The floor pan is still in good condition. That's where the fuel tank fits. This section I don't like, I'm going to remove it. All the rear inner wheel wells are going to have to be fabricated. And also the boot floor. That's the section I didn't like. And that's where it was removed from. I've been trying out this new rust converter. The original chassis rail was one millimetre thick. I'm going to be using two millimetre thick box section. I'm also going to have a section in the middle and I'm having a three mil flat bar plate on the outside. I could have brought new chassis rails, but they're over £120 each and doing it this way is far cheaper and much stronger and I think I can probably jack it in any place and it won't crush and should lift the car fine. I have drilled holes so I can spot weld it from above. The floor pan has a lot of flex without the chassis rail. It does take a while to weld. Chassis rails are super strong now and I'm really happy how they come out. The spot welds have all been welded now. This area of the boot floor, I'm not really sure how I'm going to approach this at the moment. These sections here are also very challenging. 
That's the last part of the inner structure I don't need, now removed. The engine has been stripped down for cleaning and checking. I will be doing some upgrades in a future video on this. That's the parts from the Jag. I thought I'd do a little walk around of the workshop. As you can see, it's quite a mess. I'm a bit of a hoarder. Got a new sand blasting cabinet. I'm going to make that into a vapor blaster. More on that again on a later video. This loft area I made is very useful for storing loads of junk. Well, that's it for this one, guys. Catch up with you again on the next video. Cheers.